Good morning, good evening, or good afternoon, and thank you for joining us once again in the Monsters of Gaming. I am Kaiju K. With me here is, of course, that lovely, jubbly juggernaut, Jared. Hello. Also to the side of us is Mother Maxine. Hello. And today, we're going to start our coverage on DLC classes. We're going to have all six of them done by the end of the day, uploaded and put out just for you lovely jubblies. The first one we're going to start off with is the robber's side, which is Karl Marx. Karl Marx is a pure melee character, which means he's not very good at putting down cops. Uh, the NPC ones, so we had to restart this as our second recording on this. Um, but he does come with two really nifty powers. The first one is, of course, distribution. The bottom one is important because it's called distribution of wealth. You can give an NPC, uh, this includes workers inside the buildings, $1,000, and you invite them to your commune. This money counts towards his team's money goal. So you don't actually lose the money. And if that person gets killed, you get to keep the money. So that's still cool. Also, Dictator of the Proletarian is a bonus skill that increases for every pe for the amount of people. But at base, it gives you a nice speed bonus for 7 seconds. If you have 5 or more, it also gives you 3% regeneration over those 7 seconds for 21% of your health and all your nearby teammates, by the way. At 10+, plus, you also get the resets the cooldowns of all nearby team members, which is pretty a uh, pretty badass, especially if you have two Karl Marxes, then you can keep resetting each other. I guess. Yep. And finally, at 20 plus, 20% 20 of the money for his whole team when picking up loot for seven seconds, which is a nice little pad. What he also has, which I love myself, uh, is he has a really cool little melee weapon here. Now, it has a bit of a cooldown. I don't know why it has a bit of a cooldown. But as you can see, you can just run up to these guys and go, hey, hey, buddy, hey, $1,000? Sure you do. Of course, who doesn't? If you look in the bottom left corner, you'll notice that there's now two. Uh, right next to the health bar, you see that little number there? See, there's two. Now, another thing, like I said, what is what happened here? This is what puts the heavy to shame. Because he gets this little hammer. It's quick, it's silent, it's small. It's small. And he can just run around his, over here and just like... Mm. Well, it seems like a good spot. Boom! Boom. Hey! Why aren't you booming? Ah. Uh. It's, it's still not working 100%, damn. Um, the, the devs will fix this. There we go. Okay, that goes to that wall. That goes to that wall. Yeah, I kind of have to hit him at the right angle. So as you can see, puts it right through. Yep. Right. Now, what makes this class really cool, though, is there's a lot of maps where you start off with, like, vending machines on the outside. And, uh... You can go and grab those, get a few thousand dollars, and then you can just walk around outside carefully, by the way. You have to do it carefully. And uh, you can start giving people some money. So I think Juggernaut's already been giving out some money. Right, John? Yes, I have. Okay, so what is your count? Yes, I have. What's your count in the bottom left say? Four. Four? Cool. Okay, get another one. If you can. That'll be five. Get back here. I want to give you money. Who wouldn't want to be given $1,000? Okay. 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 I've been giving money to the employees. That's fine. Hammer! So, yeah, so the X's don't always work. Um, sometimes you have to hit them from a different angle or from a different location. Now I'm at five. Okay. So that unlocks the second level of power that you have. Like this one right here won't break. Um, and what that is is now... Uh, when you use the X button power, um, you'll actually start a regeneration effect around you. It'll actually heal not just you, but all your allies uh, for up to 21% of their health. And the best part is, you can't see it activate. Which I think is pretty badass. But this also means that certain members of a group like Mama Bear, who really, you know, she's not really good at combat. Um, oh, who am I kidding? She's getting better. She's murdering people left and right now. But originally, she wasn't good at combat. I guess I should say originally. Um, <laughs> so now she has the ability to uh, run around outside, you know, being sneaky about it. Not what I'm doing right now. Not running around in broad daylight, because that's not going to work. Uh, and just hand money out to people, and they club them. Because in case you didn't know, if you kill people in this game, they start spawning back in. <laughs> But if you didn't notice, you'll notice that when I clubbed that guy who we gave money to, our money didn't go down. See? Still 1700 and That's because that person, like most Americans, has already spent their money. Yep, run around. He's bludgeoning some of these guys here. 
You already have the money. You spent it already? How can you already spend the money? There you go. <laughs> I'm trying to get up to the full 20 here. Now, of course, I, I wouldn't say that this was something that Marks did. I don't think Marks actually went around and bludgeoned people with a hammer. Um, <laughs> I mean, he might have. I, I can't vouch for the guy. I'm pretty sure he didn't, though. Uh, Judd, any, any knowledge on Karl Marks? Not that I know of. Uh, uh, I need a, I need a fact about Karl Marx. Anyone? Someone? Someone give me a, a fact about Karl Marx. The sickle. I really don't know anything about Karl Marx. <laughs> Damn, I got, we got, I got to look up something real quick here. Um, Karl Marx. Karl Marx. Uh, get back here. Get back here. I, get I, I know. Back I, here. Uh, Karl Marx. Karl Marx. Uh, yeah. Hang on, I. I will look up something about Karl Marx. I will. Give me a second here. Uh, I think I'll run over here real quick and stand here for two seconds. I'm gonna look up Karl Marx real quick on my phone. Uh, I should I should do this for all these people. I, uh, five eight two nine. Uh, uh, let's just this. Oh no, that's not what I want. Oh, not going. What do we do? Uh, Ten facts about Karl. Marx. Okay, Karl Marx. Okay. So, uh, 10 facts about Karl Marx. Real quick from mentalfloss.com. All right. So, um, his baptism at age six was most likely for political reasons. <laughs> his high school was raided by the authorities. <laughs> his weak chest helped him avoid military service. He had a duel with a jail time and characterized his college experience. He had a controversial marriage to a childhood friend. Marx didn't attend his father's funeral. Uh, he relied on Engels for money. That's pretty weird. He kept getting banned from countries. Oh, wow. Orders that Marx should leave a country within 24 hours. He started the trend in Prussia in 1843. <laughs> wow. He was plagued by poor health. And his love poems and novels were unpublished during his lifetime. That's strange. I actually have read his poems. Huh. I didn't know that they were unpun uh, unpublished. Hey, Jug. Hey, man. I have a hammer. Hey. Hey. Oh, that hits. That hurt you? Oh, yes. I, I didn't know that. Hit me. Hit me. Okay, now ready? Watch this. Ready? No, look at our health, you idiot. Oh, wow. Gosh, look at your health. He starts slashing me up. What, are you trying to murder me, you murdering funky bastard? <laughs> I'm gonna get you! I'm gonna get you! No, you're not. I'll get you! Aha! <laughs> you killed me! I did. With a hammer. Yes, you killed me. Okay, so it would appear that, uh. Well, if you notice, Jug, though, real quick, if you notice, notice that your, uh. Your, your, your followers are still wherever they were when you left them. Yeah. I guess you could say that it's hammer time. Oh, don't you, don't you make that Mark's joke at me. Yeah, this one won't break for some reason. I've been trying to break it all day. It just won't break. I'm going to try to jump out the window and hit it. <laughs> okay, that didn't work. <laughs> okay, so it looks like two Marxes can't get the full power on the map. Well, that's fine. Um, just drop off our money. But like, yeah. I'm using a rubber mallet. But yeah, like, he can literally, like, self heal himself at, like, two or three shots. 20 second cooldown. He's actually a pretty cool cat. And he can also, at full power. Actually, you know, his full power isn't all that good. Getting to 10 followers actually makes him very powerful. Actually, Jug, where are you? I need, I need you to come over here real quick. I need to test something. I'm. I'm on the roof. Why are you on the roof? Well, not not the roof roof. Cool, cool. That one can't be broken. That one can't be broken. Nice. Seventy-three thousand, man. We got a lot of money out of this place. All right, so I'm gonna go. In, I'm gonna be over at this truck here. I want to test something real quick before we get off. Because you have at least ten followers, right? No, I've got seven. Okay, we'll have to, we'll have to jump in and test that again. Come right here. Wait, behind you, behind you, Jug, there's somebody behind you. Give him money. Look that right here, give him money. 
I don't have any money. Here, hack the ATMs. Oh, man. Here, steal that money. Now give it to him quick. Don't let him escape. Get, give it to him. Okay, now come over here. I want to test something, okay? Not letting me. Okay, then don't. Come here. I want to test something real quick. Come here. So, hit your X button. <clears throat> Did you do it? Yes. Is there a cooldown? Yeah. Is there a cooldown now? Yes. Damn it. Okay. I was wrong. Okay, two Marxists cannot do that. Damn. Okay. Drop off the money. So, folks, um, this is this is Karl Marx. Uh, what would you give him, Jug? Uh, what do you think? Uh, I honestly... Yeah? I'd say he's an easy class to play if you're big into melee. Uh-huh. Uh, ba it's basic. I consider him a basic character that it, I believe would be easy to play as. I do, too. I don't like the fact that he has two melee weapons, which will be a reoccurring function in this matchup. I do know why he has a hammer and sickle, though I understand that, but... Mm-hmm. No, hammer time. Get us out of here, quick! Get us out of here! No, no, don't, don't hit me. Hey, okay. So, I mean, he's a fun class, but the next class we bring into will be even more fun. But until then, folks, uh, I hope you enjoyed Karl Marx. I consider him to be a really easy class to play as. I consider him to be a very fun class to play as. Um, and uh, next up, we will be looking at the wonders that are uh, Albert Einstein. But until then, Einstein. Folks, I am Kaiju K. I'm Juggernaut Jared. She's Mom Bear, and we will see you all in the future. Peace out, everybody.